Anyway, I'll be back in a couple of minutes after I've um, done up my uh, after I've bought some uh, items. See you in a bit. Okay, then let's get on with mission ten. Bad news. I didn't realize, you know, how long it. Um, well, uh, I didn't really think about. That's what I should say. How long it takes to actually get through, uh, get to um, no the Raptor News Network? It takes. It's taken a lot longer than I thought it would. There's a lot more mission. There's more. It's like it takes a good four missions to get through this, <laughs> to get through to the boss fight with it, boss fight with a Bob Barbus. So yeah. You were right. You're not just like your father. I see your mother in you too. You want to hit Mundus hard? This is how. Mundus has power almost beyond limit. But he has Oh, he has one weakness. What is his weakness? Please tell me. He has a weakness. Yes. What's his weakness? His mistress. His weakness is Problem, um, Mistress would uh, insinuate that he has a, actually has a wife. We haven't seen Mundus' wife actually, we haven't seen like if he has a wife or girlfriend or whatever. Lilith. So here's the controversial plot point. <laughs> so yeah, he's pretty much telling us the uh, mission that uh, Lilith is pregnant with Mundus' child, and the way we can get at him is to kill Lilith and kill his child. Which, needless to say, is kind of a um. What's the word I'm looking for here? It's a touchy and controversial plot point, I would say. That is a good way of putting it, I think. Um, so, yeah. We do have a controversial scene later on in the game, which we will see a fair bit later, actually. But, uh, yeah. For now, we're making our way to um, the Raptor News Network Tower. I'm running upside down. Whee! I'm in a circle. Let's go. So yeah, I will say the design of the Raptor News Network is um the tower in the um in a limbo is um a pretty cool design. I like it. I'm just trying to remember. Uh, that's the thing I'm trying to remember at this point. I think we do this mission and then we do the boss fight in the same mission. Good. I'm trying to remember. Finally have your attention. You attention whore. <laughs> that was stupid. Yeah, kill me already. There we go, reload me, thank you. Here we go. Wow, that was a... There we go. Fuck you. Don't shoot your lasers at me. Down we go. I will say that I do like all this, uh. And we're going into Raptor News Network. Literally. We're going into the logo. <laughs> Which is... Uh, okay. I'll give it this, at least it's original. <laughs> Hi, Bob Barber. I think it's Bob Barber, is it? Or Bob Barker? Or... No, it's not Bob Barker. Who the fuck? I think it's Bob... Bar... Oh, I'll see him in. <laughs> we'll see him in. So yeah, once again, it's just a case of... Uh, Bit of a uh, platforming. It's uh, pretty. F I don't mind the. Uh, I like the platforming in this game actually. It's one of the major plus points. 
Time to go into the logo. Yep, we've got a boss fight against Bob Barber. What's his name? Show me. Bob Barbers. There you go. Huh? Huh? Get it? He says he's doing God's work, but he's a demon. <laughs> Classy. Is that they are disgusting, degrading, ghastly, sleazy, period, and generally nauseating. The worst of them is Dante. The whole world would benefit greatly by his non existence. I'm taking you off. You're gonna try and kill me. You think so? I wouldn't bet on it, you little shit. Yeah, I need that. So, yeah, the boss fight uh, is pretty easy. Just use your Eric's to uh, destroy the uh, enemy to blow those things up, and then hit him in the face with your sword. Okay. Okay. Where are you? So yeah, you just have to keep doing this until uh Just have to keep doing this until the first health bar goes down. And then once the first health bar goes down, you have to give him a little eye surgery. Let's head into his eye. And then we have to uh and this is a, a pretty this is pretty cool aesthetic as well where it's um this is just timed, you just have to keep going while he's still talking. Fuck you! Which is kind of annoying because, um... Yeah, so we have, um... So yeah, we're getting a bit of backstory here from, um... Um, what's his, uh, for Dante as well while we're doing this. By the way, it's part again of the unsubtle nature of this game. The fact that uh, he was a uh, he was part of a he was at an orphanage called Saint Lamia's orphanage, which is of course a uh, a demon Saint Lamia. Oh, you. Ah, that is annoying. I mean, the idea of this kind of camera angle is cool, but when you start getting yeah, so there we go. Some of the stuff he's spouting there is pretty annoying. This boss fight, I would say overall, is pretty annoying. And this is a uh... how. Yeah, so now you have to destroy. Dash it! This is really annoying. I hate this section so fucking. What am I getting hit by? Fuck you, Bob. I'm gonna kick your ass. So you have to do two the second. Basically, it's three lots of this. There's three lots of this, so first time you destroy one, second time you destroy three, two, and the third time you destroy three, obviously. Give it. Destroy. Basically, this with this boss fight, I'm doing a war of attrition. I don't really give a shit. I've got three gold orbs. So I'm not going to get die here. 
the gold orbs give me uh, basically um, as soon as I die. The uh, this is hard news, Bob. I get an automatic. I get automatically resurrected. So yeah. Uh, the cool thing about this as well is that it. You'll notice that you started off at the with the first one of these things. You started off where you started off the beginning of the game, right? And um, and the second part of the the second one here, you are at the um, the um, the soda factory, which is so it's kind of like um, showing how the um, Raptor news network is. Um, the whole world is looking for you. Um, you know, so it's pretty um, cool. I do like this uh, concept of it's kind of like showing what happens. So it's almost as if this is how they reported. They're reporting what is happening with you um, with Dante. It's just awesome. I love. I do. This boss fight is a pain in the ass, but it has some really cool concepts. I will give it that. And it actually gives delivers us some exposition as well of what's going to happen recently. Yeah, which pretty much means that. Uh, So uh, yeah, Mundus is going to be. Yeah, I like this concept here. This idea of kind of giving you a bit of a. Fuck you, Bob. I this is the section I these sections are what I hate the fucking most. Keep going. Yeah, fuck you, Bob. Slash you in the face. Yeah, one last load of hits, and we should be enough. I don't think I'm probably not going to do. Especially if I keep doing that. Shit! Like I said, I get gather that I wasn't probably going to. I'm going to die here. Yeah, I'm going to die. I always die at this boss fight. <sighs> Fucking annoying as hell. Yeah, this boss fight is by far m the worst in the game. It's the most annoying in the game, it's just not. Come here. Come here, Bob, I'm gonna kick your ass. And that's it. That's the end of the boss. The most annoying in the entire game. Yeah, and Dante shoots Bob Barbas live on air. And we're back in the real world. Nice. Now here's the thing. Logically, <laughs> how does it make sense that uh, we get our angel weapon from a demon? Uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, not gonna have too much of a go. But these weapons are pretty cool. I like using these a lot. And there's the uh, v building. There's Mundus' headquarters. You've already lost. Fuck you, Mundus. Um, <laughs> but anyway, um. Yeah, these are the new weapon. These are a key, a killer. Um, basically, they are uh, throwable. You throw them, and they cut up large amounts of enemies. They're good for. Um, 
sorry. They are good for um, crowd control, like a large group of small enemies. You can use them to get them off your back quite easily. So I like that. Star points 89,000. That's a D. SS for a time. That's good. Completion. Which I don't get. It gives you a completion rank, even though... Yeah, I don't give a shit. <laughs> it gives you a completion rank, even though there was nothing to collect, so what's the point? Anyway, that's it for now. Join me. So that's it for this part. So join me next time when we'll be uh, going back to uh, the headquarters and we'll be trying to save Cat and uh, Virgil. So join me next time when we'll be doing Mission 11, The Order, in DMC Devil May Cry. See you next time.